Well, this evening, um, I've come, I haven't gone out too far this weekend. It's a bank holiday weekend, and I don't fancy going anywhere with tourists everywhere. So I've come somewhere local. I've never been here before, ever. Um, so yeah, where I am now, it's uh, on the way to the Nor the Norwig, just above Daniel, and there's a sort of track. I think this track leads you into a woodlands and uh, onto the rocks, I hope, over by Chin Padan. Um, I pass, when I usually pass going to work every morning, I sort of look over onto the rocks and I always think like, there has to be a composition over there. So this evening, after a week and a half of just bad, overcast, horrible weather, uh, I've got nice light over there. So I was thinking maybe if I was in the woods, I'd get some nice evening light coming in or maybe a lone tree or something on the way. I've never been here, it's more of an explore this. So uh, if I see something, I'll shoot it. But if I see something for another time, I'll come back and shoot it at another time. So I'm treating this more like a recce and a bit of an explore. So uh, I'm gonna carry on heading that way until something catches my eye until I get to the woodlands. I've come across this uh, old cottage over here. Um, it's a lot of overgrown trees on it, so uh, this could actually look good in winter. You know, when it's we got a bit of snow because you'd have uh, all the snow on the hills here, and this would be. Uh, I think this would work well in the uh, winter when you got a bit of snow, but at the moment it's a bit overgrown. So what I've gone for, I'm just thinking now of a. Uh, a vertical shot here you've got this sort of pillar like used to be a gate post here on the side you've got these moss on the roofing of the uh the old stone roof on here uh you've got a side here you've got a bit of tree with some uh red berry type of thing on it tree here and right at the top there you've got the tv uh mobile phone mast over there so uh yeah so with this I've gone at ISO 100, F16, at a 20th of a second. Uh, it's quite bright now, so I'm probably gonna bracket one each end on this and see how it goes. Unfortunately, I've got no cloud there at the moment. So it's gonna be blue skies, unfortunately, um, unless I go black and white. I'm just shooting this anyway. It might not even be any good. So a bracket of one each end. And yeah, so this is a vertical shot. I can see another cottage down there. So I'll probably have a walk around there and see what that looks like. Um, the cloud is moving in, but I haven't really got the time to hang around here. So that's just a shot. Don't know how it's gonna be. So I'm gonna have a look down there, see if there's anything of interest down there.
Right, I've come to this uh, next cottage over here. Uh, I think I can get another shot from above the rock there after looking down. I'll have a look. But this, I like the side of this uh, shot. You've got the side of the house. I like the green wall, the mossy thing. Now you've got these twisted kind of trees that really make it. You've got the wall leading from here, leading into the side of the cottage. And it's them um, twisty trees that are really sort of weird. Plus the backdrop. Uh, you can see the Isle of Mangles in Hollyhead Mountain right at the background there. So uh, now I've got the sun peaking in the tree there. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go F16 because it'd be nice to have that. ISO 100. And that's at 80th of a second. Uh, will bracket on this one. Uh, because because the left of the frame is pretty dark and um, this is bright I'm gonna have to go to each side I think well I'll try one each side and uh, see which one works for best so what, what I'm hoping for with this view is that sun burst shot there just makes it lovely so yeah that should make a nice shot and I really like the view in the background looking out Anglesey you probably won't be able to see Hollyhead Mountain because I am on a 16 mil and at 16 mil so that'll be quite far away but it's these this wall and these twisted trees leading up to this old cottage that look really good uh, ain't got midges here but you get them bloody big annoying flies that just keep buzzing your face every minute so I'm gonna go to the rock now and there uh, See what kind of shot I get from there. Well, this hasn't really turned out the way uh, I expect it really. Uh, it doesn't seem to be a path going to where I want it to go. Um, so that's not the way to the woodlands, unfortunately. As for getting up the hill or the mountain, uh, the ground's been too, it's just too saturated with all the rain we've had in the last week. So uh, it makes the climbing up there uh, twice as hard. So. Uh, I'm not going to bother with that. Uh, yeah, a bit disappointed really. But never mind, that'll be another location for another time. Uh, so yeah, I think what I'm going to do now, uh, I'm going to head down to Jan Peris, Um And I think I'm going to shoot Jan Peris, uh down there. But not a lot of people tend to shoot Jan Peris. I don't know why there's still a good view there from the lake with the power station on the side. Um, so we're going to have a little wonder down there as the sun drops. Maybe we might get some colour later on, about half past eight, I don't know. But in the meantime, I think I'm just going to go just down there and uh, see what happens.
shot. Um, I've had some nice swirling cloud above, which is like a leading line for the midges to come out. I've also flown the drone up to the castle. So yeah, um, I'm at F16 ISO 100, 30th of a second, I'm bracketing one each end. Right, I've changed the lens 24 to 70 uh, on this. I've, uh, on this. Right, I've changed my lens to a 24 to 70 just to get closer. Uh, the shadow is causing like a curve, which looks pretty good actually. So I'm trying to capture that. So 100 with this as well, F16. I'm bracketing <laughs> on each end. Right, I think I'm going to give up here. Uh, too many people, it's insane. So, yeah, that's the shot for here, plus the uh, shot with the drone. So, uh, yep, here are the images. then a uh, <laughs> bit of a mixed bag this this vlog um, I tried to shoot there I did my best uh, there was about 30 behind me I just couldn't like concentrate I think I got the shot what I was trying to explain there there was like a swirl in the cloud that was like a leading line uh, which I thought looked good not sure if I got it um, but I think I did so yeah, what I've done now, I've come, I thought on the way home, I'll pop to the uh, lonely tree. Uh, too many people here, they're everywhere. Uh, half past seven at night, still everywhere. So yeah, it's chaotic, so that's why I don't like shooting on a bank holiday Monday. Uh, my main plan was to go down into them woodlands, but uh, I just couldn't find the path to get there, so probably another time I'll see if we can get there so i think that's it for this vlog um i hope you enjoyed it and until next time thanks for watching and bye